Walk. Thank you so much for tuning back into my channel. And of course, my well, first of all, I hope all is well with you and yours. And on the calendar, today marks the first day of autumn, of fall. But it's like I love, I mean, I love the, a mixture of all the seasons, but it's kind of just on like, you know, the whole transition from, you know, the spring, summer, you know, I love doing my hair and headdresses and everything, and to make my beautiful cocktails. Mm, I love to celebrate. But anyway, but in the spirit of the um, transitioning of the, the seasons, I'm just going to say welcome. Welcome, Autumn. <laughs> ah, welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh, make sure my hair welcome don't forget to like subscribe turn on your notifications and if you like to leave a comment even if it's just to say hi we'll say hi back so welcome on thank you so much for tuning back into my channel and today is officially the first day uh according to the calendar the first day of fall so um don't forget to like subscribe turn on your notifications if you like to leave a comment even if you just to say hi i will say hi back i'm trying wendy's um pumpkin this is um i gave me this cup but it's their pumpkin spice um frosty so I know like I have been so curious about you know well I don't know because like during the season you always hear about people talking about oh they get into this whole pumpkin this pumpkin spice or pumpkin latte I don't know what it's all about I'm more of the chocolate and you know caramel type of person those are my um my go-to's but I was like okay this year I was always like, I'm gonna try to try some of the um, pumpkin spice and find out what's going on. Like, let's see, maybe I would like it or not. But this, um, I'm trying to look over here because I have a pull up on the website. It says the pumpkin spice frosty. And it says, tastes like fall. Tastes like fall, okay. And then it says it combines um, a creamy base that you love from the classic vanilla frosty with um the flavor of pumpkin and warm spices like cinnamon and nutmeg now and i said it's like eating a pumpkin pie a la mode in every single bite so as i say it's a limited time this is um very so i got a medium so um i'm not sure if i like but i was like i'm just gonna give it a try um because i'm not really into like pumpkin lattes and spices and all that. Cool. Let's try and see what this um what this frosty goes. I definitely do smell the spices like cinnamon. Uh oh okay because I don't want to be too much. So I have a little spoon here. Let's see what this all is about. I mean, what are your, what are some of your favorite things? I don't know if I want to go and, um, I want to try Dunkin' Donuts and, um, Krispy Kreme, their little, I'm um, a Krispy Kreme, um, to try all the donuts they have, but it's like a dozen donuts, I'm not going to eat that many, and especially some I don't even know if I like, but let's see. As I always say in my videos, I know I hate it. <laughs> you know, because hands down, I've always loved um, Wendy's chocolate frosty. And then I've never had their vanilla frosty before. But I did try their strawberry frosty, and that was good. This, I think, um, 
And then I tried too when they they did something like a, a breakfast 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 coffee type of thing with their frosty. The frosty is really good. Um, to me, that reminds me a little bit of eggnog, and I'm not a big fan of eggnog. Um, but it, it's not horrible. It it kind of makes me think of eggnog. A little bit but I would eat uh well resume eggnog if eggnog tastes like this I do not like eggnog and um I, okay on my scale of one to eight I would have to give that and I'm taking out of the thing because even though it reminds you of that um uh what's that thing called again at like Christmas eggnog but it's like if eggnog could taste good this is what it would be and i do taste the frosty in it so i would think on my scale of one to eight i will have to give it a six because it does taste good um yeah i'm mean, like it's 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 not off-putting and especially i'm saying on that scale to give it a six out of eight when it kind of reminds me of something i really don't really like with eggnog but I think they did a good job. Um, I wouldn't order it again. I wouldn't necessarily recommend it. And that's not a bad thing. I'm glad I tried it. I'm not disappointed at all. I think it tastes great. Um, but uh, so happy first day of autumn. Once again, this is Rock Care Rock. Thank you so much for um, tuning into my channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on your notifications, and you leave a comment. Even if it's just to say hi, I will say hi back. If you have any suggestions, anything you want me to try, and it doesn't have to be just, you know, related to food or anything, because I'm into all types of things. And if I'm a licensed professional hair, nail technician, um, wax and uh, you name it i love it. i love it all i'm an instructor and i love all this stuff professional bartender um and so it's like and i love to do art and i love music and so just just let me know it doesn't have to be just specifically just let me know it doesn't have to be specifically just related to food um and it's like you know because i create hairdressers and all that stuff so if you have any questions suggestions Feel free to let me know. And don't forget to share the channel. So tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend. And then we can all be friends. <laughs> Until next time, this is Rock Care Rock. I'm Mark Tanay. Bye, baby.